Hey, booze. Hey, it is your girl, the Rising Phoenix Empathic Combination from Maryland. I want to get on and show off my new haircut. That's right. I got a new haircut. But let me tell you about my haircut. My hair, it looks so thick and full and healthy, but it was so damaged, so damaged for me covering my hair up with braids, covering the damage up with wigs, covering my hair up in protective styles, and I really wasn't giving it the, giving it the proper maintenance and the proper care. And my hair began to break and become so damaged. And even though when I would do my hair in protective styles, the twist outs, when I stopped wearing the braids, when I stopped wearing the wigs, when I stopped wearing the, the, the protective styles, my hair was so very thick, you really couldn't tell that there was any damage done. And so I continued to walk around with the damaged hair because it was so thick you really couldn't tell and it began to break more and it got worse and worse because when you don't deal with the source root of the split ends it will continue to split up and up and up and up and up and soon the hair was so damaged that I could no longer hide it I could no longer pretend that it wasn't happening and I had to address it and so I did the big chop and I'm starting all over and I'm maintenancing my hair and I'm dealing with my hair such is life with our traumas and with our mental health. And I'm so crazy that I'm in this season of healing holistically, dealing with the root cause and not covering up with makeup, with lipstick, with clothes, with my accomplishments that I'm hurting, that I have been broken, that I have been through trauma. Right, that I have been betrayed. Not just one specific betrayal, but a lifetime of hurt and pain that I never dealt with. Walking around, hiding behind a beautiful interior when my exterior was in pain. And I want to tell you, chosen ones, it's going to get to a point where you can no longer hide. And before you have the breakdown, before you become ill from the stress and pain and trauma that you have not dealt with, I am asking you, I'm calling you to deal with your stuff. Do the shadow work. Go to therapy. Sit with yourself. And do the work necessary so that you can heal within. So that you won't have to cover it up anymore. And you can be whole. And you can be healed. And you can be free from the grips and pains of the trauma that you've experienced.